coming from a um, an Italian Canadian family of which uh, there's been four generations of contractors. So my father being the third, and my brother now who uh, is running Fram, which is my father's company, um, was I could say genetically created to take over the company. First born, kind of pretty old school. So you know the dinner table discussion was always about building, and that Frank was going to take over the company. And thank God he's really good at it, um, which is fine. But I, uh, it kind of freed me up to, to do something else. So I uh, always wanted to be an architect. It was a kind of Brady Bunch thing, maybe I don't know, but uh, but I just thought it was an exciting, um, an exciting field to study. And uh, architects, as far as my father's concerned, kind of just make his life difficult. So he wanted me to be an accountant or a lawyer, which I'd be a horrible accountant or lawyer. And so I decided to be an architect, and and I went to work for a firm, two firms, uh, before I started my own practice that did institutional work, that did daycares and city halls and community centers and churches. It wasn't until Pina and I, uh, after she graduated from uh, her master's, getting her master's degree, that we set up our own firm and we got a bar. We never designed a bar, we hung out at bars and just loved designing hospitality. And then my brother called me up one day and said he needed some help on some urban design on a project that we did for them, a successful project in Mississauga. It was only then, you know, which was probably about five years after we actually started our practice, that we actually started working for Fram as a client. We're working now with Cadillac Fairview, which is taking that kind of experience that we had with regards to urban design and adding this amazing commercial and, and, and retail uh, expertise. And it's been a great synergy. And we're really excited. And, you know, every day you keep learning and uh, experimenting. So it's been, been quite a ride so far. Looking forward to the future.